Hey, yo, what's up, guys? It's Saints, and welcome back to another episode of Fashion Friday. If you guys don't know already, this is a series I do every Friday showcasing outfits that you guys submit in GTA Online. And if you want to submit an outfit for next week's episode, let me know in the comment section. I'm actually going to be trying to give shout outs to all the people who submit them so pretty much from now on i'll say your name if you did or if i do use your outfit but anyway getting right into the outfits the first one from the red viking he submitted the soap mctavish outfit if you guys have played call of duty especially the modern warfare series you know who this guy is he's one of the main characters and his outfit is actually pretty cool so to make him what you're going to want to do is start out with a black t-shirt, then go ahead and put faded blue jeans on underneath for the pants, then black work boots, go ahead and put on the super heavy armor, and then for the hair, put the brown biker hair on, as well as the stubble facial hair, and then obviously make that a little bit brown too. And this actually looks pretty cool. It, it's pretty close and pretty similar. I forgot to mention you actually need to put the tan parachute bag on your back as well. And uh, it gives it a really nice look. And if you're not really a fan of Call of Duty or you don't really care about soap, then, I mean, it's kind of like a casual war-ish outfit. So if you don't want to be, like, as military-esque as some of the other ones, then this is, you know, a really good outfit for you as well. Moving on, though, the next one we have is called The Mime, and this one is by Shiny Games. So thank you for submitting it. And it's a pretty simple one, so you don't want to put a white tuck shirt on with a black bow tie. For the pants, put on the black suit pants. For the shoes, all black Oxfords. For the hat, a black flat hat. And then obviously go ahead and throw the mime face paint. Hair pretty much is up to you. But, you know, maybe you want to be a mime. Now this one is probably not going to be one of your main outfits of choice. But, you know, hey, if you ever need to be a mime, then you can always have this outfit on deck or ready to go. If you were in a situation where it was needed. Anyway, moving on to the third outfit, we have the Fallout Boy. And... This one is pretty simple, and this one is submitted by Joshua Hoffmeyer, so thank you for that. And to make this outfit, you put on the blue track jacket, then put on a yellow baseball tee underneath it, and then put blue track pants. And then for the shoes, you can either put all black, I think there's a gray canvas shoes, uh, obviously that's pretty much up to you. And then for the hair, go ahead and put on the short brushed hair with the 42nd color, which is yellow. And that's like the closest hair I could get to, obviously, the Fallout Boys hair. And uh, as you can see right here... If you want to just go around in Los Santos and just give people the thumbs up, I guess you could like role play a little bit with it. But yeah, that's a pretty cool outfit. I mean, I love the Fallout series, so this is definitely a fun outfit for me. It's nothing too special. And like all the outfits, I always say this, don't take them too literal or too serious. It's not going to be 100% perfect. Obviously, we're in a, in a GTA game, so, you know, it, we don't have unlimited options of making these characters. But for what we have, I think it's pretty cool. Moving on into the fourth outfit, we actually have a really, really simple outfit, but it's still pretty cool nonetheless. And this one is called the Space Monkey, and this one was submitted by Elderly Gaming. And literally, all you need to put is the flight suit, and then put the pogo mask on. Now, I know some of you guys might have uh, ran into that glitch a couple of weeks ago where, like, it took the pogo mask out of your inventory or doesn't show up anymore. Uh, unfortunately, then, I guess you won't be able to do it unless they patch it. I don't even know. <laughs> But, uh, because it never got taken out of my inventory, but you need the pogo mask for this, and like I said, really simple, really cheap, and but it's pretty cool, because I mean, who doesn't like the pogo, the pogo mask, it's a really cool mask, so using it with the flight suit, maybe you can even glitch and get the actual helmet on with the mask underneath, so you can actually pretend you're a space monkey, but yeah, it's a really cool outfit, really simple, and uh, really easy to do. And then moving to the fifth and final outfit of this week, we have... I guess you would call it the Vietnam Soldier. I don't really know of a better name for it. I guess you guys can maybe come up with one in the comment section if you want to. But this one was submitted by Ben Higgins. And it's a fairly simple outfit as well. What you're going to want to start off with is the forest combat pants. Then go ahead and put a white tank top on. For the hair, go with the high slicked hair. And then make it brown or black. I guess really it depends up to you. Facial hair, you, it's up to you as well. It's basically whatever you want. I just went with nothing. And then some other optional accessories are the forest backpack as well as the forest helmet. You know, if you really want, you can add those. If not, I just added the forest backpack because I think it looks pretty cool. It gives you the, the straps and stuff. Makes you feel more, I guess, like a soldier in the game. But yeah, this is another pretty casual style of war or military-grade outfit. 
you know, if you don't want to be all suited up in the, the you know, the full gear, then uh, this is a fun outfit to go mess around with as well. But anyway, that is it with this episode of Fashion Friday. Hope you guys did enjoy. Like I said at the beginning, if you have an outfit for next week's episode, let me know in the comment section. Thank you to all the guys that did submit these outfits, and hopefully we get some cool outfits for next week as well. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe for more awesome GTA content. And as always, it's your boy Saints fan. I'm out. Peace.